So here I have the broken Omnicord. As you can tell, percussion works. Um, the buttons don't work. However, I do have tone um, from the generator to the main chip, which is the core generator. So this is the tone generator. This is a, a top octave generator. It creates, well, in this case, 13 notes. Um, it only uses 12, though. Sends the 12 into the core generator, which then for each root note knows how to develop the, the third, the fifth, the seventh, and also the minor third, and to do auto bass accompaniment. Now, I'm getting nothing out of it. Ooh, I gotta fix that. Even though all the, uh, all the inputs to it are good, I've verified that, you know, it's getting the, uh, the pulsing bass signal. I can even, I can even show you. Let's see, that's around pin 25, call it. That jumping up and down there, that's, that's the bass signal. Um, anyway, so I found the, the data sheet of this guy. And I found that pin five is a reset pin. And I said to myself, well, let's let's check out the reset pin. What's it got going on? Reset. It's almost five volts. Okay. So I figure, well, let's ground it and see what happens. So here's what happens. I ground it. Ooh, what's that? So, Omnicord works, works fine. I just gotta figure out why I've got a high signal to pin five on this chip. And uh, everything else, you know, works great. Just gotta uh, solve that one mystery.